Joining me is Jonathan Romaine, a pivotal voice in art and activism. Jonathan, welcome. Thank you for having me. Thank you for coming in. So we know that your work, it transcends traditional art. And not only are you creating art, but you have positive and specific messaging behind the work that you do. Can you tell me a little bit about Art Inc.? Absolutely. Art Inc. is a, a nonprofit, uh, 501c3, that was formed specifically to try to have a safe, creative, and fun space for young people at some of the most pivotal hours in the, the day. Um, my wife and I, we're both artists, and what we wanted to do uh, and direct as a direct result of some of the negative things that we've seen in our community all of our lives was to use the strengths that we had, the talents that we had to try to make a difference. Definitely. So mm -hmm. what age do you say you kind of developed your, your passion for art and begin to act on it? I've always loved art, um, never took it seriously because as a kid I always thought that either you were born really gifted or you weren't mm -hmm. and even though I was decent when I compared my art to professional artists I was like eh, it's not that good and so I never took it seriously and then unfortunately I ended up going to prison mm. and while I was in prison I started painting and drawing just to pass time mm -hmm. and because I was just totally focused on it the work got better and better something that I didn't know would happen if I kept doing it and at some point while I was incarcerated I made the determination that I was going to use art to change my life. Wow. So completely turning a negative into a positive. 100%. And that's what change that narrative is all yeah. about. It's just using my life example mm -hmm. is how art made all of the difference in the world to me and trying to use that in some of these younger people's lives to make a difference in them as well. And I know now you're an author to add to the list. So tell me right. about your book. So this book is actually a collaboration of so many things. You know, it the, the, it was born out of one of the meetings that I attend with the SNA group. Mayor Rita Ali, she formed this group and charged us with coming up with different ways that we could make a difference in our community. And the whole change, that narrative was born in that platform. We wrote a grant, and we received a grant from the R3 grant from the state of Illinois, mm -hmm. which actually subsidized this book. And then we're in a partnership with Peoria Public Schools. We're going to be taking the art into the schools, talking to the kids about change that narrative. So, and more important than all of that, we have over 50 artists that agreed to be a part of this project and share their artwork through this book. And now the art exhibition with all of the art from this book, which it will be here next weekend. Yeah, so when is the date and the location the 12th for and this? The 12th and the 13th yes. at the... Um, Four Points by Sheridan, downtown Peoria, or 500 Hamilton. Um, and it is, we're having a VIP reception on Friday night from mm -hmm. 6 to 9, and then Saturday is open to the public, free of charge, from 12 to 7 p.m. All right, and we're going to be sure to have that information on our website as well. Thank you. I mm -hmm. wish we had more time. Your story is so <laughs> captivating and amazing. Thank you so much for joining it's me. It's my pleasure. Thanks for having me. We'll be right back.